today's video I wanted to share with you my top favorite purple lip glosses lipsticks and all that jazz I do also have on a red <laughs> strapless top so no I'm not naked but if you would like to see all of my top picks please keep watching okay so I pulled you guys in a little bit so you'd be able to see uh, and I'm actually wearing my first item and that product is the NARS velvet lip glide in Le Main blue and this is an interesting product because it's like a mix of a lip gloss and a liquid lipstick it kind of stains your lips but not to the degree that a lip stain would and it's glossy so it's a very interesting formula this is really nice for the summertime i have actually not worn this at all this summer i think i'm gonna take it with me this weekend uh it's just a beautiful beautiful color i think it's nice and shiny you could apply this without like really being super precise i love a good color like that especially in the summertime because i just like a good get up and go and this is like a grape jelly color really really pretty it's gonna have a little more lasting power than a traditional lip gloss so even if the shine starts to fade maybe you've eaten something or had something to drink uh, you're still gonna be left with a little pigmentation so this is NARS Le Main blue really really pretty shiny color it almost reminds me of another lip gloss I have that looks very similar and it's called grape jelly by ABH this kind of reminds me of that but the grape jelly is going to be a little more pigmented with this color you still get to see a little bit of your lips so it's a little more of a natural purple <laughs> if you could call it that my next lipstick and honestly you guys while I was going through my collection I really love the color purple and I thought that I would have a lot more purple and I don't so this was a hard video to put together because I really had to think about all the purples I have and I only have about three more than all the ones I'm showing you. But this is one of my absolute favorites. This is the Bite Beauty. Let's see, this was the, I think it was called the Frozen Berries Collection and it's a matte cream lipstick in the color Plum. This is one of my favorite of all time purples, especially for the fall time. I'm gonna apply it. I just love this lipstick so much. So this is the color Plum. And one thing I love about these Bite Beauty lipsticks, they are so smooth and creamy. This color just, Oh, it's it's so beautiful I love wearing this color with plaid I think it just pops it's really comfortable on the lips it's a full coverage lipstick it's so creamy it's pigmented it's not exactly matte so that's nice sometimes you kind of don't want a matte look maybe you are just glowing elsewhere and you just want to have a regular lipstick if you've never tried out the bite beauty lipsticks formulation please try them out they are probably in my top three lipsticks of all time uh this plum color is absolutely beautiful this collection actually came with all berry toned hues and i think i have two or three of them but this is definitely my favorite really nice like almost like a wine color like this is just a sexy color i love it and it's not too too intense but it's just enough depth and color to give you a really nice purple lip so this was the color plum okay the next color is actually by mac i debated about whether or not to put this in the pink or the purple category but i definitely think it leans more towards purple and this is max flat out fabulous i will always remember this color because i got it from my girl jackie here on youtube lushing beauty and this is just bomb a bomb color so let me apply this and this is a matte
Okay, so this is Max Flat Out Fabulous. Ooh, you see how it just like, mm, makes you just want to do a little shimmy. This is one of those colors that I don't wear too often. I think I forget about it, you guys. I have probably over a hundred lipsticks and I need a new makeup storage organization. Anyway, we're not talking about that. This is one of those colors that I forget that I have and then when I wear it, it just makes me so happy. I love the formula of this lipstick. It's a matte, but on the lips, it just feels like powdery and amazing. I just love, I love everything about it. It's a pinkish purple. It's bright, but not too bright. I adore this color. I think this is one that will look amazing on anyone, hands down. I just, it is flat out fabulous. Like, in every aspect it's amazing this is one of my favorite if you have not tried matte flat out fabulous and you're looking for a matte purple for the summertime or even the winter this would be amazing i love wearing shades that you wouldn't normally think to wear in that exact season like i love doing a dark brown in the summer and a color like this in the winter because it's going to be the little pop of color that you need to just set off your outfit and uh, flat out fabulous she is just fabulous like clearly she's amazing so definitely try that one out if you have not okay my lips are getting a little stained the next color is actually a liquid lipstick and i most recently showed this in my kat von d liquid lipstick collection <sighs> love this color i haven't worn it all summer all year actually probably need to replace it because it's so old but it's an amazing color and i think it's one that a lot of people really love because it's just so striking okay this is miss luv i love this color um it's like a bright neon purple totally striking it's like a badass color like i love this i love wearing this color with orange not with orange with yellow i think it just really pops this is just like a i'm gonna set it off color like just do this with a nice monochromatic look or with a really pretty floral printed dress and amazing this is a color i would wear year round i just think it's nice and bold enough it's very striking i love kat von d's liquid lipstick formulation i don't know what else to say about this it's just it's quite amazing it's just beautiful um yeah if you're looking for a liquid lipstick in a bright shocking purple color i really think that you would like this also check out that video of my kat von d liquid lipstick collection down below because i have another purple that you might like even more but the application of this one the formula just everything it is just perfect i love it love it love it love it lord I don't know why I tried to do that without any makeup remover. If you wear liquid lipstick, one thing you're gonna want to get is an oil and gel lip remover. This is by Sephora. It's called the Ultimate Oil and Gel Lipstick Remover. I'm not sure if they still sell it. You guys know Sephora tends to redo their products every so often, but this product, it's mm, amazing. If you wear liquid lipsticks and such. The last color I'm going to share with you guys is a color that's probably discontinued by now. This was the first liquid lipstick I think that I ever purchased from Sephora. Yeah, it is. And I always talk about this because I purchased it on my day that I went in for my interview to work at Sephora. So this was many, many moons ago. It is an old color. Probably also need to throw it away. It's even older than the last one I showed you. But I loved the formulation of Sephora's cream lip stains at the time. They have redone them, so they are a little bit different now. But this was when they were like amazing and this color is so pretty. It's called Zero Four Endless Purple. And it is perfect. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I love it because it reminds me of a purple, but like a, a nudie purple. Like it's very toned down. 
it's still dark but you could totally see how it's kind of like a nudish purple if you guys kind of get where i'm coming from love this formulation super comfortable on the lips the color is perfect it's just it's not too striking it's not too bold if you haven't yet tried purple lipstick which i would highly suggest that you do try something like this is going to be great especially if you have darker skin because it's going to look more natural because it's a very like warm tone purple it looks very neutral ish at least to me you guys might think differently but i think it looks kind of neutral uh purple also looks really good with brown eyes so if you have brown eyes you might want to try a purple as well but a shade like this is going to be really nice to start with because it's not too striking it's not as intense as something like this but you could definitely work your way up to that and this is just like a really nice pretty safe color and this is called Endless Purple by Sephora, number 04. They might not have it anymore, but hopefully they have something similar to this, and I'm sure they probably do. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love bringing to you guys my favorite lipsticks. This has been one of my favorite series just because I am a lipstick lover. And in doing this series, I've also found that I have way too many shades of everything in my collection. But next month, I think we'll be doing pops of color. So those will be the colors that I don't really have other colors of, but they're just really bright, striking, and bold all things that I love. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.